Hello guys, my name is Austin and welcome back to Grand Theft Auto Online. This is season 2 and this whole season is about career progress, completing all 29 of the career progress challenges. All of them take an extremely long time, there's 4 tiers on all of them and we've actually completed 0. We're pretty close to finishing up a couple of the challenges but what we're going to be working on in this video is actually contact missions and if we go down here to premium deluxe repo work this is what we're going to be working on it's something that has been available to us for a long time we've just kind of put it off but this week it's actually triple money so what better time to do it other than when it's triple money we're going to be repoing some cars for our good pal Simeon and maybe we can be the employee of the month before we jump into them we're just going to look at all of the challenges really quick so we kind of know what we need to do in this video the first one complete a repo work mission for Simeon Uteri super easy complete a repo work without dying and complete all eight repo works I don't know if we're doing all of them in this video I want to but we'll just kind of see how long they are the next one complete a repo work on hard difficulty and then complete all eight on hard difficulty we're going to be playing them all on hard difficulty so if we can complete all eight on hard difficulty and at least not die on one of them we'll have the first three challenges complete beat them on hard without with at least not dying on one of them first three challenges done super easy the tier four is a little bit harder complete all repo missions on hard difficulty without using snacks or armor hard complete all repo works all repo work missions taking less than 50 percent damage also really hard and then do them all with better than 80 percent accuracy these I cannot guarantee, but the first three I, I'm pretty sure I can guarantee we're going to complete tiers 1, 2, and 3 in this video. We are here at Simeon's dealership. We spent a lot of time here in the beginning of story mode. We haven't played story mode on this channel before, but we will definitely in the future. We got a Tesla. We got a Lambo. We got some other cars. We're not about buying cars in this video, but what we are going to be doing is going into here. Oh, Simeon, hi, I didn't know he was actually going to be sitting here. And let's launch the first mission. And we are launching our very first repo mission. We have to beat all of these on hard difficulty. And we have to at least make it through one without dying. We do have loyal viewer MTC. He's been in so many videos in the past accompanying us. Hopefully we can get through these rather quick. And I'm also curious to see how much they pay with three times money. If you see this car here right in front of us, you're probably wondering, how did you get this vehicle? You guys are going to see in the next episode where we bought several new tuners vehicles and a brand new business. I'm not going to tell you guys which business. I've already filmed the next video before this one. But if you can put two and two together and know tuners vehicles, there's only one business it could be. But I'll leave that up to you guys and you will see it in the next two videos actually. One we buy it, the next one we do some missions for it. But it looks like this very first Simeon mission, we're going to a warehouse. It might be like that, um, like the recycle plant, I think, is what you, you go there with Lamar and uh, that other guy in story mode. Stretch in D. I used to do a bunch of Simeon missions back in the day. Like all kinds of Simeon missions back in the PS3, back when I used to like grind rooftop rumble and grind contact missions. Because those were the best ways to make money nowadays. The only reason we're really doing this now is because it's three times money. I wasn't planning on making this video. We're actually not going down to where I thought we were. We're going somewhere different. I don't know exactly what we have to do. Are we actually going inside? Big house storage. I don't think I've ever been in this building in my life. I bet it's just like a large warehouse interior, but we're going to see. Oh, it's a vehicle guard. We gotta, st we gotta start destroying it. Rail gunning it up. Oh, I don't want to destroy that beautiful entity. Entity done. Oh, they're all entities. Okay. Where's the other one at? See if I can yeet a grenade up and over it. He beat me. Okay. Did you check the basement? No. We gotta go down to the special vehicle basement. Okay. I'm sure there's more entities down here. I actually don't think that's the Entity XF. I think it's the new version of the entity that came out. Probably with this update or right before it, it would be my guess. We got a Phantom Wedge down here. Okay. Eventually, we're going to have to buy all these cars. 
But our priority right now is saving for businesses. Now we have to go all the way back up to exit. And we're exiting the building. I would assume we probably just have to drive back to Simeon's, or is that is that it? My vehicle's gone, which is nice. Okay, well, we requested it. Which one is it? We're gonna railgun him up. Oh my goodness, there's a lot. Let me get my vehicle. I know we're not supposed to use snacks or armor, but we did it. I'm gonna die. Holy shit! Armor! How did I not die? Do not ask me, I do not know. I feel like they're almost infinite spawning. Okay. I'm assuming we're just heading back to the dealership now. Leave the area. We're going to see. Not my smoothest performance there. I probably should have just not ran for it, but we did. We're going to go hit this ramp over here and leave the area. Let's go for it. Oh, that bus is in my way. I'm guessing we're heading back to Simeon, so I'm going to start heading in that direction. I hope we make decent... Nope, actually, we're done. I hope we at least make, like, with triple money, like, 50. It's not bad for probably, what, five, six minutes of work? Let's jump into the next one. We I don't know how we didn't die on that one, but technically we made it through the one we have to without dying already. Jumping into the next mission called Do You Even Lift? I don't know. I don't... I mean, I, I lift the controller. That's about it, though. I don't know what we need to be doing. We're starting at Simeon Uteris as well. We've unlocked a new reward. Oh, he has the scramjet. Find a cargo bob. I love missions with cargo bobs. Said literally no one ever. Does it give you a hint where one is? You're going to need air power or cargo bob if you have one. If you don't, let me see what let me see what he says. Let me see what I can find. So we just have to wait around, maybe? I mean I know we're at a I know there's some helipads here. I don't know if that's where it's going to spawn or not. I don't have a cargo bob. At MTC maybe has one. I think this is a newer character because I think he used to have a different character. But I don't know if one's here or not. But I'm, I, I guess we're going to find out. If not, maybe after a couple of minutes, Simeon gives you the location of one. Hopefully, it's in the city. If there's not one here, I'm going to go check the airport. I don't think there would be one in the airport, though. Oh, actually. Let's go! Black cargo bomb. Great. I will let him fly. He's flying it. Okay. I guess let's see how far we have to go. Do you have the chopper yet? I found one that you could borrow. I'm in a back lot of the movie studio. That would have been a good spot as well. So we gotta go steal four cars, but one at a time. Wait, I'm gonna see if I can get a different cargo bomb. stupid double stupid not only was I trying to get a video on YouTube while I was doing that um, cargo bomb mission I crashed my helicopter and then for some stupid reason he's going to get his car I did not hit quick restart so we're in a different mission now we'll have to do that cargo bomb one again in the future and I'm not gonna crash it this time I'm just stupid I'm going for B so hopefully he hits a I know he's in a scram jet Looks like he is hitting A. TC's a solid teammate, man. We played with him way back on season one. He's been a solid teammate for probably six months. We don't play with him, you know, a whole lot, but when we do, he's very solid. I, I would imagine, hopefully this one's a quick one. We just steal the vehicles and move on. I'd imagine these guys aren't friendly. Ah! Assault shotguns OP. Where's the other ones at? There's one. Okay. I mean, hopefully this one's just a nice quick one. I get my car, he gets his. Get back to the place, and then hopefully we can do that cargo bob one again. Even though I don't want to do it. I hate cargo bobs, but 
You're a professional. Yes, good, because you um, every dent in the in the car is coming out of your payment. I wonder if that's actually accurate. Like, I know it's that way on, like, the, the auto shop sell missions or even, like, the special vehicle cargo or the bike delivery in our MC Clubhouse. But I wonder if this actually affects payment. I would imagine not. Looks like he already has his. He's a bit closer. But let's head on down there. And we are almost down to the docks. This one was the easiest one by far. Like, literally. Killed a couple people, drove the car, almost crashed it again. And nothing crazy. Like, a relatively easy mission. So let's hopefully... Let's see how much we get paid, and then let's jump into the net. Oh, there's more. Okay. Well, I was wrong. Let's go get two more cars. We got those two more cars. Let's see how much we get paid. Still really easy. This was the easiest one yet. 49. Not bad. That is a really good amount. Let's jump into the third repo mission. back on the cargo bot mission and I thought I could just drive it away but the garage is locked which is so annoying but let's continue speeding it up no it wasn't destroyed that's stupid I'm not coming I'm not doing this mission yet we'll, we'll go to a different one Okay, so the next mission we're on, which we've still only completed two, is called RV Nearly There. And we have to steal a brigade. And it looks like there's a bunch of RVs around this. I would assume that we gotta kill these people. But how are we gonna get the brigade out of here? That's what I wanna know. How am I gonna get the? Are we just gonna start driving these things out of here? I, need to I mean, I can't even get that one out of here yet. Let me get the one he had, and then I guess we just have to clear a path, quite literally. I don't know if we need to pull it that far, though, buddy. I mean, really, I think we don't have to get all of them out of the way. But if we can get these couple out of the, or maybe he can be on defense mode. I guess this one's next. He died, that's okay, I don't want to die. There's a lot of enemies though. Yeah, I need to get some body armor on. There's a lot of them, where did all these guys come from? Jesus! Where are all of these guys? It's someone behind me. You are destroying me, bro. Is he getting in this one? So honestly, one, I mean, really, this is the last one we need to move. Brigade's still at full health? Oh, but you can't just back it up. That'd be too easy, huh? I don't think we need to move anymore, honestly. I feel like we can probably get it out after this. There was a lot of enemies. I don't know what, 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 like why they all came after us, but they sure did. I'm guessing we got to take this back to Simeon's is kind of my guess. He's going to be in the scramjet. Let's take it all the way back to the dealership. wasn't too bad. It, 
I mean, it, it sucked a little bit moving all those RVs, but other than that, it was nothing hard. Just a long drive back to the city. A lot of people attacking you, which were annoying, but I mean, overall, nothing hard about it. If I could get around this corner, that'd be super nice. Slowly but surely. Jesus goodness. I don't want to run you over, man. And we did it. Uh, still, the cargo mob's the most annoying, so let's see which one we're going to do next. The next mission we're in is called Under the Hammer. Looks like he's driving my car. That's fine. Oh, I don't care either way. Looks like I'm driving my car. And we got to go down to Mission Row Police Station. We've never done this one before. I'm guessing... Oh, I just bumped. I'm guessing what we got to do is repo some cars. That's what all of these are about. The one with the cargo bob is just the most annoying. And it's actually not going to be Mission Row. It's the police station. What's that road called? Uh, Strawberry? I don't know. I don't think it's Strawberry. I don't know my GTA road. We're in Strawberry right now. I seen in the bottom right. I don't remember what this road's called, but we're gonna be down there. Dave, no, Davis is Franklin's road. Like Franklin's Auntie Denise with all that asses road. Well, let's head down there and see what we got a repo. Looks like there's two cars. I don't know if there's gonna be two more or not. That's kind of been the thing, is there's always been four, or most of the time been four. And I might as well try to get us as close as we can, right? Maybe this wasn't the best decision, but we done did it. Okay, that's a some kind of Lambo. He can probably use my car for cover and drive it down there if he wants to. I want to help him, but I also want to not die. So far, we haven't died on any of these yet. I'm not get, I'm not going nowhere till I see him in his car. There's a chopper as well. Not on my watch. He's in his car. That's not what I wanted. Okay, he's going. My time to go. Let's equip armor. I just dropped my gun. Okay, I don't want to actually drop that. He's going. I would, I would imagine there's four. But let's get down to the docks. And we did it. Nothing too difficult. We only had to get two this time, which was nice. But let's jump into the next job. We are in the next job. So far, we've done four out of eight, but we've actually been in five out of eight because we failed that um, cargo bot mission twice, which we're going to be saving that for last. But we're halfway done with completed missions. And this time, we have to go to Maze Bank Arena. A little bit interesting. We, I did back, well, I didn't intentionally back all the way up, but it kicked me all the way back out of free roam. And I did glance at career progress, and four of them have counted as complete, which is real nice. Let's head on down to Maze Bank Arena. We're in the Porsche now. I have a couple of other tuners vehicles that we'll probably be using throughout the video. And there's at least two more. I think maybe three more. But I bought a lot in the next video, which is after this video that I filmed before this video. Very complicated. But hopefully there's only two cars we gotta get, because I do not enjoy the ones where we only... Oh, are we getting those? I was gonna say, I don't enjoy the ones where we have to get four. I'll take the blue. I don't know if I was supposed to do that or not. It's called a Sasquatch. I didn't even know this was a car you could get. I thought he was getting in mine for a minute. What do we got to do? We got to destroy vehicles in them. Not what I, Can I use my guns in these? I can. Not what I was expecting. But some of these repo missions, like the very first one we did where we had to destroy cars, were not necessarily meant to be repoing cars, but were destroying competition's cars. Where we had to go into that, you know vehicle cargo warehouse and destroy the enemy's cars. Can you just drive these over in this? I don't want to risk blowing up my Sasquatch though. But we're going to try it. Oh, okay. There's a whole lot down here which I honestly feel like sticky bombs probably will do it quicker and safer. So that's probably grenades. That's going to be my game plan is just grenading them up over here. I don't know how we get to it, but I'm going to figure it out. Is this them? I don't know. Are they inside? I don't even know where we go to get to those vehicles. Oh, they're all out here. Okay. I feel like I could go quicker on foot, to be honest. 
Grenade launcher, maybe? I feel like that's honestly going to be the quickest. Not what I meant to do, but I'll take it. more inside and then there's a couple of other cars in other places but we're at Benny's sorry Benny we don't know oh I like the sound of that one we don't know Benny yet on this account but we'll get to know him eventually I don't know if there's any career progress for him or not I'm gonna go hit down here he's destroying those other ones I mean clearly they wanted you to get out of your car because there was gasoline here really the tramp Let's go get this last set, though. Okay, so I think that's all of them. So perfect, I want you to do it again. There's more. Okay, well, let's do more. So this is the last one, I think, is right over here. I went ahead and ran these ones over just because the police was all, all in my business. It should be the last one, though. So we just gotta go down to the docks. Not too bad. We are here delivering the Sasquatch. And that should complete mission five out of eight. Okay, so I used the bathroom and I'm already mid we're already midway into the next mission, which I feel bad because TC was doing all the work, but I was in the potty. So let's finish our... Is there only one car this time? I think there's still two cars down there. Let me get them to it. And I honestly don't know what we're doing on this mission. I, I, I mean, we're stealing cars. I know that much. But let me go get one of the cars. Okay, so we're here at the airport. This is the first time in these missions we've had to come to the airport. And I, like I said, I feel bad because this mission was already underway. Or are they loading them onto the carrier? Maybe that's unique. There's his scramjet. Make sure I can still get out of here. Oh, we got a Bugatti. Hell yeah, we do. Mr. Tate would be proud. What color is your Bugatti? Well, let's lose the cops. Some of them we've been able to call Lester on. Some we haven't. It's been kind of random. I've been trying. Like the last one we can call Lester on. I'm guessing you don't yes, want I can. Rub. Perfect. How can I help? Well, I'm going to take this okay, back my friend. to I'll take care of the LSPD. Our... Leave it to me. Oh. That's annoying. I guess it's because I drove back through here. I'm trying to find my way out now. I get so lost in this place, man. Okay, right here. I'm going to head back to the dealership. And I'll see you over there. It's on the way. We are here delivering the cars. I was a little bit late to the party. Do we have to go get more? No. Really easy. Not too bad on that one. We only have two more missions to go, and one of them, which is going to be the final one, is the Cargo Bob mission. We are jumping into the second to last repo mission. This one is called, I think, Burn Rate? Something, yeah, Burn Rate, which I used to watch this awesome show called Burn Notice back in the day. I don't love the color of this car. I'm probably going to change it to gray or something, but this is, after this, there's one more tuner's vehicle. Find a fire truck. I actually do know where a fire station is probably head to the same place he is we could probably call 911 as well but I only know where this one well I think I knew where it was before but the main reason I know where this one is is because in the brand new salvage yard missions you have to go here to steal masks for the mission row uh, robbery yes he's going to the same place I am I mean I, there is other ones but this is the one that I can think of there's another one down by the police station like there's another one like somewhere down here did I just park this right in front of his fire truck? No, but maybe I should get a different fire truck. I don't fully know what we're doing. He's on his way. We're going to the terminal, so I think that means we're going... No, not to the airport. Maybe we're going to Elysian Island? I don't know, but... Uh, make sure the fire station will loan you a truck if you ask politely. Just make it quick. Okay, well... Conveniently, we already found two fire trucks. It was taking me down to that other one I was telling you guys about, I think. I have to wait on the train. Just land on the damn train, CJ! I'll cool him down a little bit. Let's head down to the terminal. 
Okay, so it looks like he beat me down there, but it looks like there's a genuine panda leather interior burning into a crisp. Where the hell are you? So he wants us to go and put out the fire, which is kind of a unique mission. And I wouldn't necessarily say it was uh, exciting, but it's unique. But none of these missions are really like super fun or whatever, but so far we've made almost 300k, so honestly not bad money. We have to go down here and save the cars, I guess. I do love that you can do all of these solo, but it would take so long to do these solo. Especially the ones where you gotta get four cars. Oh, some of those are good guys. There's the Eurus. There's the Alventador. There's another Lambo back there. I don't know which one I'm supposed to be saving here. Is this another Eurus? So it's all Lambos, a whole Lambo shipment. Some of them take longer than others, I feel like. Let's waterboard the enemies. I'm gonna go for this one. Oh, I'm on fire. Oh, that doesn't seem good. I don't like that one bit, I'm on fire. Uh, when a fire truck catches on fire, that is not a good sign. I'll just be on killing. Which we still have a while for vehicle health, but... Oh, his is on fire too. I guess I'm literally... I'm just going to try to do it mine. Worst case scenario is I blow up, I guess. But I guess I have to try, right? I didn't know his was on fire too. I have two left. I'm not on fire anymore. That's good. He didn't die, which was surprising because his blew up. He must have hopped out in time. I'm going to die, though. I'm going to get out and put body armor real quick. Then we just got to take out the rest. This was a very unique mission. I don't hate it. It's also unique that there was friendly guys? I think, yeah. A very unique mission. I'll let him go get those ones down there. I'm gonna see if I can't snipe this guy. Not dead. Dead now. Shot him in the peepee. -pee. Let's see if I can't get some sniping in. Is there more down there? I think that's all of them. We completed the second to last mission. The only one left is the Cargo Bob mission. So I'm gonna speed that up for you guys.
after more failed attempts, we're finally here. We had a system down. Oh. Okay. You can do it then, buddy. He really wanted to deliver it. No, I'm kidding. That was obviously an accident. Um, I was getting him on the car kebab, bringing him out of the locked fence they're in. He was driving them back. Not worth 76000 So far, we've done all of these, but I guess after looking at it, I've only done seven out of eight on hard mode. So I'm going to go back and do the last one on hard mode, and then we're going to see how much money we made from all of these. And we finally completed them all on hard mode, which should complete the first three tiers. Like I said, the fourth tier, we're going to have to play them all again. And there is a strategy involved. If you play with other people and you just sit AFK, you don't take any damage, you don't use any snacks or armor, and you fire zero bullets, the game actually counts that as having 100% accuracy, even though technically you didn't shoot at all. That is the easiest way to get tier four. But we have the first three completed, so let's claim our rewards. Not that we're ever going to use any of it, but, you know, we have them. And we've actually done three out of eight on hard mode without using snacks or armor. We've done three out of eight, taking less than 50% damage. And we've done two with better than 80% accuracy, which is actually really nice. But like I said, that wasn't our goal. We completed all of these for the first time in this video. Thank you guys for watching. Like I said, in the next video, we're actually going to be buying a brand new business. I'm not going to say what it is. I think you guys might have an idea, though. Thank you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. I just want to add on there real quick, guys, that I actually made 431000 I should have showed you that earlier. Definitely not a good way to make money. It took over an hour and a half to make less than a half a million. So even with triple money, not worth it. If you want to jump on with some friends and, you know, have some, you know, some good time playing some simulator missions, go for it. But don't do it to make money. Even with it being triple money, it sucks. So just probably don't do these, but... I only did them because we had to work for career progress.